everyone, it's Raquel of Raquel's Carbon Cuisine. And today's recipe is going to be some Jamaican style escovish fish. And this is some beautiful fried fish topped with a delicious pickled sauce. Absolutely amazing. So in this bowl, I have four beautiful, fresh, nicely washed and clean red snapper fish. And this is one of my very favorite fish. But any type of fish would work great for this escovish recipe. Now I'm just going to slice a few incisions so the flavors would be able to penetrate within. Then I'm going to season this with some salt. And I'm going to use my favorite jerk seasoning. Yes. And this consists of garlic and onion, ginger and cloves, black pepper, pimento seeds, celery, cumin, just the whole works. Quite flavorful. So nothing else would be needed really. But you could use your very favorite fruit seasoning, all purpose seasoning. We're just gonna season this nicely, okay? Make sure to get in the cavity because we are going for some great flavor. So now that the fish is nice and ready to cook, I did went ahead and prepped the escovish pickle, which is some scotch bonnet peppers, of course. Yes, some fresh thyme, bell peppers, pimento peppers, some garlic, some carrot, and some onion. And this is smelling really, really nice now to my frying pot with cooking oil nice and hot i'm going to add some garlic and fresh thyme to kick start the flavors now in with the fish and make sure the oil is fairly hot before adding the fish to prevent sticking and i'm going to fry these for about three minutes on each side or until they are crispy and beautiful then when they are done i'm just going to remove them to drain any excess oil and just continue with the rest Right, so now that our fish is beautifully done, nice and ready, I remove majority of the cooking oil from the pot, leaving only about a tablespoon and all the remnants of the fish flavor. We're going to make the escovish pickle sauce. I'm going to saute the onions, the scotch bonnet pepper, everything except the carrots, only because the carrots were thinly cut and I don't want them to overcook. I am going to saute these only for about a minute and these are smelling amazing. Then I'm going to add a quarter cup of white vinegar, yes, some pimento seeds, about a tablespoonful of sugar, just to balance out the tanginess of the vinegar. Now in with the carrots and I'm going to mix this nicely. Now we're going to flavor up this. I'm just going to add a tad bit of salt, also a bit of the jerk seasoning, taste, make your adjustments. Just going to give this just about another minute and it's done and the total cooking time of this escovish pickle sauce was about four minutes this is smelling absolutely delicious now i am going to add the pickle sauce on top of the fish which makes this escovish fish without the pickle it would just be fried fish and make sure not to forget the pickle juice and if you think this is looking good oh my goodness the taste was out of this world my mouth was watering while editing and what's best to go with some escovish fish than some delicious festivals this was just amazingly delicious and a full ingredient amount will be listed down below in the description box and i want to thank you so very much for watching and remember if you like this video please do not leave without clicking the like button